Here's a quick one for you guys today. Stick around and we'll get right to it. Let's take a look at a few rig control commands from the command line. Now, notice that FL rig is already opened and running, so we're going to be passing these commands that we type here through FL rig onto the radio. Let's get started with RIG CTL space hyphen M space 4. That just tells rig control that we're using radio 4, which is FL rig. We'll give it a space and then we'll give it a lowercase f. We'll press return and that just gives us the frequency that we're currently on. Let's run the same command again, this time with a capital F, and we're going to give it a new frequency. As soon as we press return, you can see that the radio has shifted to the new frequency. This time we're going to run the command with a lowercase m at the end, and that tells us what mode the radio is sitting in. You'll see here that this is USB-D, which for rig control translates to PKT USB for the 705. If we change that on the radio to FM and run that command again, it will let us know that we're in FM mode. This time we're going to run the command with uppercase M and then give it the mode that we want the radio to move to. We'll press return and the radio moves to USB hyphen D. Next, we're going to run the command with the lowercase l and then RF power all in uppercase. And that tells us the power level that we're running at. Note that it is in decimal format. To change the power to 5 watts, we would use capital L, RF power in all caps, and then 0 .05. If we press return, you can see the radio has moved to 5 watts. Would you like to see all of the possibilities with rig control? Just run man space RIG CTL and press return. And this document will give you all of the possibilities.